Yeah. Is you got this some luggage. One of, my, one, one of them your yeah, one of them is yours. But my favorite guy is Captain Okay, it doesn't matter. We're we're gonna share. <laughs> hey Spartacus. What is it? Are those the stuff that we pack up when mommy I'm listening to you. Are those the stuff when we pack up when we're going to a different house? Yeah, that's the stuff we're gonna use. All right, you guys, stop before Spartacus chews the wheel off of it. Spartacus is going to a doggy shelter to bunk her down for the storm, you guys. Oh, big-headed boy. You big-headed boy. He said, I don't want to go. I'm going to miss my family, but I don't want to go. I'm going to miss you guys. I don't want to go. You can't make me go. You don't want to go, Sparty? No, he says no. I don't want to go. Don't make me go. Don't make me go. Don't make me go. Oh, Sparta, cause your breath smells like a dog. You been hanging out with dogs? I told you, dogs ain't no good. Birds of a feather flock together, Sparta, cause you handsome boy. Okay, okay. He's so excited. Okay, okay, okay. Do, 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 do. Okay. Chair. What chair? Say that step chair. You want the, the white step stool for the kids? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let me go get it. We trying to get Spartacus in the car. Okay. Let's see if Mr. Spartacus, who can get up in here, you want to put like a towel on it for like anchor? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Let's see if he could do it. He like, I don't know what that is. Come on, Spot. He can't do it. Come on. Okay. Okay. Let me deadlift then since. Oh, it's gonna be a deadlift. Here we go. And clean jerk. Hit. Oh, Gigi, you are one strong mother. <laughs> Cause that's a 60 pound dog. Oh, Sparty, you did it. You did it, Sparty. You so strong, Gigi. <laughs> no, Dog, you so strong. Jesus, my heart would have been aching oh, after man. that. My chest. Friends, forgive me of my <laughs> hair. I'm just trying to get things together for this hurricane. Your hair looks great. No, I didn't do it. Well, thank you. Yeah, guys. Wait a minute. All right, Sparty. Yeah, that's why I said I got to do some dead now. You got all your snacks? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got all your snacks, honey? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I love you, Spartacus. Yeah, I love you too, big head. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, y'all. Don't worry, don't be alarmed. I haven't finished my makeup today. I didn't even know if I really wanted to put on makeup today. I just got on brows, honey, brows. But we've been watching the news this morning. Spartacus is at the doggy motel not a motel hotels because motels be make you itch might come back with some bed bugs or something what yes so uh basically the mayor was that the mayor what's this in my face am i dried out of toasts was that the mayor gg the mayor was basically telling us and i'm about to put on my real florida accent down here we got gators and things the mayor basically came on TV and said, now look here now. I know lots of y'all's trying to figure out what's going on, but I'm trying to tell y'all what's going on. There's a storm out there. And it's just getting stronger and stronger, hour by hour, and we ain't coming to get you. Now we done told Yern, we done told you and Yerns to get up out of here, okay? To evacuate these places, get yourselves away from this storm. Nothing's more precious than your life. I don't care if you love your dog. I don't care if you love your pet iguana. We ain't come to get you. We ain't sending our first responders and the police people after you because you didn't want to leave your pet fish behind. Okay? Your life is more valuable. And basically what they said, they ain't coming to get you. And the man keeps saying it. 
And he keeps, he keeps, I can't even say that he's being mean, y'all. Because he just, he, it seems like he's getting agitated by the question. Uh, don't mess with those rocks, Izzy. They keep trying to figure out, well, should we, should people leave? And the man keeps saying, I know I already told you. Better leave now. You and yours. Because we ain't coming to get you. Ain't that right, Gigi? They said, they ain't coming to get you. Because it's going to be too dangerous. And I know a lot of people are like, well, what is a hurricane? What, what is that about? A hurricane is not like a tornado where we're waiting for something to like drop out of the sky. Come on, Izzy. Oh, it's, it's lots of wind and rain. And give me a kiss. And debris. And the wind right now is supposed to be like 150 miles per hour. Now, I ain't trying to stand outside. Okay? Or be near some water. Okay? With 150 mile an hour winds. I'm trying to be far, far away as I can. You know what I'm talking about? Because the man, the mayor said, I ain't coming to get you. I ain't, I ain't doing that. You're going to have to wait on top of your house several days. They ain't coming to get you. You've been warned. But I mean, I guess he has to talk that way to people because people don't understand you can't be passive about it. You know, you can't be like, well, we're saying that you should leave. No, leave now. And it's weird because they were saying that this is the first um, big hurricane that's really like going to hit. Oh, your truck. Oh, look, look, it's your truck. Oh, okay. It's gonna hit. Like every, I think the reason why people in Florida are so like relaxed about it is because we haven't been hit by an, an actual hurricane in so long. It's always comes towards us and then kind of veers off or comes towards us and dies down. But this is a category four. And I think they said it hasn't, it hasn't, we haven't had a hurricane to be for sure that it's gonna come this way and hit and make landfall in 100 years. So of course in 100 years, if we always, it's kind of like the boy who cried wolf with all these hurricanes, you know, even Hermione. But Hermione was only like a category one or two, and that's like, you know, just some dust on our shoulders. But a category four, ma'am, ma'am, that's pretty intense. All right, guys. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Hi, and we're off. Gigi. Hi, guys. Crazy. Gigi is not crazy. Gigi. Why don't you sit back? Why don't you sit back? Hey, hey guy, why don't you sit back so that seatbelt is across your chest properly, sir? What is it? Julian is in the passenger seat, behaving like a nice young man. But why, Max? Why, why, Max? Why? What did your face ever do to you? So we're headed to um, the hotel. Yeah, but there's oncoming traffic, so we gotta pay attention. Um, y'all, I got everybody ready. All bags are packed. Three days worth of clothing. Yeah, we're going to the hotel and the after party. And after the party, we're going to the hotel lobby. And after the hotel lobby, I don't know what we're gonna do. We can't tell nobody. You tired, Julian? Okay, so we made it to the hotel, but this lady literally is unloading her whole life. I mean, she got her dog, his kennel, his water, his everything. I mean, she is just taking up uh, time. You know, there's this little, this little parking area where you get out to take all your things out. But I got kids and it's like raining. I can't get out the car. Gigi's waiting for me. Look at my nails, y'all. I've been so nervous today. I done bit off like most of all my nails. Look at this. I, Nervous, okay, nervous, just about life, about I don't know what's going on, and then I just feel all alone. I'm like, why me, Lord? But I'm not gonna go there today. It's fine. I got Gigi. That's all I need. But this lady, I mean, she take a whole, whole. I got kids, and then Gigi standing at the door, like she don't understand why I'm waiting in the car. I'm not getting my kids out in this weather. I'm just gonna have to. I have to wait. Sometimes you have to wait when you got kids. It's tough when you're the only person who has kids and then people don't get why you're moving so slow. I got kids. 
I got a trunk load of stuff that I've got to get out of the car. Right? And I can't have y'all out in this weather. Like, running. I'll park my car later. I'll get soaking wet and, and look like a wet chihuahua. But I'm not going to let my kids do it. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah, I want to get these kids out. I know. I'm going to push it up there and I'll just come back down. I'm ready for somebody to make it. Ooh, okay. We're here. This is nice. Smell. Awesome. Woo. Oh, and you guys. This is nice in here. It's newly renovated. Show you guys it later because we're gonna be here for like three days. There's a bar. Oh, for when the kids go to sleep, Mama gonna get me a drink. <laughs> she thinking about the wrong thing. Some Wi-Fi hotspots. Oh, are you okay? It's going around like this. Woo! Woo! So dizzy. Oh, oh yes. This is really nice. Uh, uh, Very nice, Gigi. All right, we're gonna head up to the room. Izzy, you be careful standing by that elevator door. Don't run over my toe, Bean. Jojo, you're so amazing. There you go. All right. Hi. It's only on Disney. It's only on Disney. It's only on Disney. Okay. Okay. Izzy, come back in here. Nope. Come on. Come back inside. Come on. You can do it. Nope. That's not a skateboard. Okay. No. Ma no. No, sir. No, no, don't try and push it. <laughs> Fill your brother's cup with ice too, baby. Good job. Now, Julian's gonna help you. That's awesome. Gonna open? You want me to open? Yeah. Oh, okay. We're in the hallway, y'all. Yeah, down. Okay, we're looking for a trash. Izzy, this way. Izzy, come on. This way. They should have a trash can. They should have a trash can somewhere around this joint. Yeah. Mm. It makes me nervous being this far up like this. You see? Oh, here it is. Here's a trash can right here. Just come, come, from, come away from me. I don't like that. I don't know, y'all. Okay. It will fit. I'm gonna make it fit. I'm gonna make it go fit. Yeah, so the whole hallway gets more like this. Okay, Izzy Busy. Come on, my love. Come on. We'll have breakfast in the morning. <laughs> okay, guys. Let's go. We're all here. We're all safe. We're trying to weather out Hurricane Matthew. Um, we had to evacuate. So, I'm a little bit stressed out right now, you guys. I'm tired too. I'm, we're going to get into um, pajamas and everything. So, yeah. Just going to try and like calm down. Cause I'm super stressed out, y'all. Like, y'all don't even understand the amount of emotions. The amount of emotions that I have right now. Um, just trying to 
be happy for everybody. And we're gonna weather this. We're gonna be we're gonna be fine. I trust to believe that we're gonna be five into category four. Um, I have been picking up the camera, but I don't know what it's gonna be like tomorrow. I don't know if the power's gonna be out or what's gonna happen tomorrow. So I mean, I'll be living my life as normal as possible while we're. Held up. I literally been nervous like all day. I've literally been biting my nails off and I tried to paint over it. Look, bit my nails off, y'all. Just uh, bit my nails off. But anyway, I will talk to you guys later. How about that? And just say prayers for me and my family as we weather this Hurricane Matthew. And I'm not going outside. We're not going outside. Uh, but, um, I thought you were dying your hair. I'll see you guys. Love y'all. I can see this is a